Joining me in the studio is Hannah Holma from the Women's Center. How are you doing, Hannah? I'm good. How about you? I'm doing well, thank you. And so we are talking about Domestic Violence Awareness Month. Yes. It is October, and that is Domestic Violence Awareness Month. And so first of all, before we jump into um, what you guys are doing for the month, just tell us a little bit about what this month is all about. Yeah, so Domestic Violence Awareness Month is to raise awareness with the community on the impact that intimate partner violence, domestic violence has on um, all members of our community. So we really just want to take this time to specifically highlight that impact. And so what are you guys doing at the Women's Center to highlight this month? Yeah, so we have a couple different things going on. There's um, going to be some fundraising events around the community. You might see some little ribbons up in windows at a couple different businesses. Um, and then Packrass is going to be doing Shop for a Cause, which is on October 17th, where we will have some awareness materials and some staff there that um, shoppers can speak to to learn more about the Women's Center. Um, there's going to be some, some deals at Pack Rats as well during that and you can win um, a gift card for spending $10 as well. Um, we're going to be having ribbons up around the community, um, specifically around the courthouse area, purple ribbons, just as a reminder um, that that October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month. Um, I'm trying to think of everything off the top of my head. <laughs> right. um, we're going to be having some booths up around the, the community, um, specifically at Northern Michigan University. And then we are also going to be working on, weather permitted, um, a little spinoff on Walk a Mile which is uh, an awareness campaign for survivors. So we'll be doing like footprints outside of the courthouse on the sidewalk in chalk with stats on um, the impact specifically in our community in our state. Great, and so this is also a big year for the Women's Center. Yes. Right? It's 50 years of the yeah. Women's Center and so there's a big celebration not on Domestic Violence Awareness Month, yeah. but in November, at the beginning of November. Yeah, right? so Domestic Violence Awareness Month is kind of our build up to our, our big celebration event, which is on November 4th at the Marquette Regional History Center. Um, it's called the Heroes Gala. So we're gonna be honoring a few people and agencies in the community that have really supported the Women's Center in um, getting to 50 years. So we are the longest continuously operating domestic violence and sexual assault agency in the state. and. Our arguably in the country, but definitely in the state. So it's a really big deal to be celebrating 50 years. That is great, and congratulations on Thank that. You. Yeah, and so, you know, why would you encourage people to just, you know, reach out to you guys, go to your events, learn about how domestic violence impacts, you know, people and mm -hmm. in what it means to this community to be aware of this issue. Yeah, I think the biggest thing is that um, domestic violence and, and experiencing domestic violence, um, it can happen to anybody. And we sometimes think of like the traditional um, blonde woman with a baby and a, a black eye that shows up on the front stoop of a shelter, but but um, that's not the traditional people that we work with. It's it's everybody. So um, coming to these events, um, attending our fundraising events, um, coming to the Women's Center and seeing what we do, it's important so that everybody realizes that we're there and that they're not alone if they are experiencing domestic violence and there are people there to help. Excellent. And so if people do want to reach out to you guys, learn more about what you have going on or how they can either, you know, help out your cause, whether it's fundraising or uh, just helping out with whatever you guys need, how can they uh, find that information or how can they reach out to you? Yeah, so our website is www.wcmqt.org. That's going to have all of our information on it. Um, we also have a 24-hour support line, which is 906-226-6611, where they they can speak to an advocate that is a, a local advocate that works at the Women's Center 24-7. Um, those are going to be the two biggest things. We also have a Facebook page that's just Women's Center that will have all of our upcoming events and things like that. Great. Well, thank you so much, Hannah. I really appreciate you coming in today. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, and we'll be back with more Local 3 News.